Now, the story tonight of a uh, teenage runner who really put on her Buffalo Strong attitude, really put it on display the other day when she, she stopped in the middle of a race and she stopped to help out someone she was running against because that person was injured. Tonight, 7 Eyewitness News senior reporter Eileen Buckley tells us what happened and how it connected two strangers for a moment they're never going to forget. I was looking up and I stumbled on a tree root and I didn't think it was anything, so I kept running. But then I completely collapsed and my foot wouldn't let me like walk. It hurt so bad. 15-year-old Paige McGorry of Sacred Heart Academy is recalling how she was injured last Tuesday during a cross-country run at Como Lake Park in Lancaster. It brought together two students who didn't know one another. I saw a girl like laying on the floor sobbing, holding her ankle, like looking around for like someone and I was like, oh my gosh, I can't believe like She's hurt. That's when Mount St. Mary High School senior Gabby Dispenza knew she had to stop to help. Gabby came up. She asked if I was okay, and I was saying no. And then my teammate Jane came up, and she was helping Gabby. Mm -hmm. I was pretty scared because it was it's not a really known area of the course. I wasn't going to leave a girl there in the middle of the woods. She could be like a freshman, sophomore. She was probably scared. And she was like shaking, so she was probably in shock too. Gabby and another teammate tried to pick up Paige together, but it didn't work. So instead, Gabby lifted Paige up by herself. I went like, just like a baby. <laughs> so I just carried her like this all the way back. And she literally picked you up and carried you? Yes, literally picked me up in her two arms and was carrying me. Carrying Paige to safety for help. I'm just so grateful. She handled it so well. She was telling me that it's going to be okay and that like, and that everything's going to be fine. She was saying she's going to get my parents. Gabby credits her work in the Explorer program at the Getzville Fire Department that trained her for emergencies. I was just glad I was there. I was actually thinking about, like, not going that day. But I'm really glad I went to be able to help her. She was so selfless to, like, give up her race to help me. And she didn't even hesitate to help me. And that was a moment of serendipity being in the right place at the right time for a positive outcome. In Lancaster, Eileen Buckley, 7 Eyewitness News.